today because we had a meeting with Dr. Lisa Anderson and during that meeting we reached no neg the, the negotiations resulted in nothing at all. She actually got suspended five more students and she ordered the, the maintenance people to come and remove the gates of the uh, gates uh, three, five and the portal. Last night us the student movement we built up those gates again to keep to keep the people who are living in the dorm secure that the university sacrificed their security. We're here because we're not going to stop doing this. They made us reach this decision, and we're not going to, the student movement will not stop the way the gates are closed until further notice, or in other words, until our demands are met. We are not going to stop what we're doing. They are stealing our money. They're telling us that the 7% increase is only about the inflation of the country, and in fact, it's about the deficit that they're having. They're, what, they want to collect our money to keep their deficit away. This is not accepted. The, dictator, the dictatorship is no longer available in Egypt. We are bringing the revolution inside the constitutions, and we're going we to get the, this corrupted system down. The people are, we, we, us, the student movement, who are being beaten up. We are, be, we are being suspended because we're call, because we're only for calling for our rights and for all those people's rights. We're having right here a human chain, which is made by females, to prove that we're non-violent and the civil disobedience is not violent by any means. Uh, how many students are back in? How many students are back in? At first, we had, uh, we had, petition, uh, we had uh, petitions on papers. We gave them to the Dr. Mithat Haroun. He took the petitions and he teared them up in the meeting. So afterwards, we decided to make a petition online. The petition today, this in this morning, reached, I don't know what, what exact number it is, but it, it crossed the 3,000 people. So, so more than 60% of the whole university is supporting our movement. We will not stop until our demands are met. What, what, what can dismantle this situation? What demands, what practical demands what are practice? you suggesting? Before negotiating with the, with the university again, the gates will not, be, will not be open until the 7% increase that is uh, said to be continuing till 2015 is no longer there. And the introduction of the tuition caps, that means every single returning student does not have to pay with the, the same uh, increase of the fees as any newcomer. You don't tell me that I'm going to pay 100,000 100, pounds in my first semester, and then when I'm, when I'm graduating, you're telling me I'm going to pay triple that amount. This is not acceptable and this is not fair. Do you have any practical solutions for... Uh, we, did, we did have solutions, and with, uh, during those meetings, we introduced our solutions. We introduced our solutions. There, there is misallo misallocation of money. The, the, the amount of money we give them is enough to, to, to get the quality of education higher and the quality of services. We did make plans to reallocate the money and tell them what to do, but all they said is this is not your business and we're going to do things our way and we're in control of the university. What, what, what they treat us like slaves. What, what, what solutions do you think are very practical? And right different. now, we have to accept our simply our first two demands, then we're going to negotiate about the rest of the demands we're, we're calling for. They made, this, they made us reach this decision, they never listened to us, it's time for it's time now for the, for the, for those people to listen, or the gates will not be open. Thank you. Sir. Thank you. Okay. Uh, okay, we're standing here because we believe in what we're doing. We want 
the, we want we're closing the gates until our demands are met because we we're asking for our rights we're asking for the decrease in the tuition fees it's our right because we don't receive any services or education in return we're going to stand here until all the demands are met and we're doing like a human chain we're girls standing in front of the gates because the other girls were in the dorms yesterday were not protected they removed the gates and then we're here in order to, to ensure their safety that's it Thank <laughs> you.